What's up guys, Anubhav here. Welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel. Now 2021 is here in the month of January. Everyone is feeling super productive, including myself. So I thought why not curate a video talking about some of the best productivity apps that you guys should definitely use to kickstart your productivity, supercharge it, and you know, basically do what we want to do this year ever since 2020 was such a bummer. With that said, in today's video, we're taking a look at five impressive Android applications that will definitely supercharge your productivity for the better and help you be more active and proactive when it comes to doing work as well as completing our daily tasks. With that said, be sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel and I'm super excited for this. So let's not waste any time and let's get started. Alright guys, the first application on the list is called Taskade and while this is more than just an Android application and it has a lot of features that are available on all platforms and cohesively match through everything we do including PC, Windows, iOS as well as Mac, today we are going to be focusing more importantly on just the Android application. Now Taskade in general is a real-time organization and collaboration tool which you can use with your team to get stuff done very very easily and very very simply. Now the amount of stuff that the the app allows you to do is absolutely amazing and you can add and create beautiful tasks, lists, notes and outlines. You can share and collaborate with others instantly. For example, as you can see, I've added Utkarsh, who's also my good friend and the editor for this channel, into this YouTube weekly schedule and once this is added, he can access this app either on his laptop or on his phone and work with me in real time. Meaning, if I add a task and then he completes that task, he can check it off and that will be updated in real time. There's also a place where you can can directly call and talk quickly with your team members whilst being inside the application and all in all a lot of different features that we originally had to use separate applications for but stuff that now you can do together there's obviously inviting team members to workspaces chatting and working together in real time adding different people adding different tags doing at the rates and different sorts of features real time syncing beautiful and minimal interface with a lot of really cool colors that would rather make this very intimidating application super easy to use and very simple to get into now i highly recommend creating a new workspace when you install this application and also check out the guide to taskade which is already one of the inbuilt workspaces inside the app now while there are a lot of features that would be impossible to explain in an app countdown video like this i do have planned a dedicated video to do for taskade because all in all i've been using it for a long time and this is one of the best applications in this list definitely check it out there is a lot of features that we will talk about in the video soon to come but for now give the android app a shot and i'm sure you guys will absolutely absolutely enjoy going through it link in the description below be sure to check it out all right guys moving on we've got an application called action dash which is basically a digital well-being and screen time helper now this is an application which takes digital well-being into the forefront shows you how many times you're using your phone throughout the day and while i have made a dedicated video on this app itself a couple of months ago i think when we're talking about productivity applications the main thing that comes into the forefront is how we can use our phone less and this is an application that lets you do that. Now it takes digital well-being app as a starting point and makes it available to all Android users. The app gives you very concise information about the different apps that you are using, different types of apps that you should and should not use throughout the day. Also create different schedules so that you know you don't really use Instagram or other social apps when you're working throughout the day by locking different applications. And it has biometric authentication so that only you have your phone use its statistics, checking how many times you unlock your phone. You can also manually click into an application and see the daily, hourly, as well as the weekly usage of that application. And all in all, this just takes denial out of the way, shows you exactly how many times you're watching, scrolling Instagram when you could really be doing something more productive with your life. And honestly, I feel like it's a great wake up call application this new year. Definitely check it out. Link will be in the description below. Oh, and did I mention it's completely free? So yeah, definitely check it out. When we're talking about productivity, security is one of the first things that comes into my mind. And this is is a perfect segue into the next app on the list which is Dashlane. Dashlane is a password manager that takes care of you wanting to remember all your passwords as well as taking care of the health of the passwords also giving you VPN support and giving you the option to save passwords across a plethora of different devices along with having a password generator that generates very complex passwords that are practically unhackable. Hey, I mean this is an application that I have been using at least for the last two years if not more and what started as 
as a collaboration for a YouTube video has turned me into a customer for Dashlane Premium. Even if you don't buy the premium, you get one device support along with 50 passwords to be saved at lifetime. And there's no cost to actually start using the application. It's great. It's got a VPN, as I said, a password generator, a dark web monitoring application, and also a place where it lets you generate different passwords, which are of varying strengths and you can copy and save them. The app does it automatically. So your passwords are safe, your accounts are secure, and you don't even have to remember it. The only thing you do have to remember is the master password that it takes when you have to open the application to unlock it. You can also turn on biometric authentication. And honestly, even the premium is pretty cheap, factoring in at about 50 rupees when it comes to INR per month, which is really, really cool. So be sure to check it out. Link will be in the description below. All right, guys, next up, we're talking about an application that you guys have probably seen a lot of times in a lot of these videos on the channel. This is the Stuff To Do List widget. Now, sometimes you need a widget, something that you can put on your home screen so that you can view it every single day and add your daily tasks and notes in it. You don't need something fancy, just something offline so that you can add either your grocery list or, you know, writing a paper, completing an assignment, anything basically that is ad free, convenient and minimalistic checks all the boxes for me. And this is the application. The app in itself is a widget. So you just have to add it on your home screen and it's super, super simple and super easy to use. And honestly, there's not a lot to say. It's very cool. It's very minimal. Be sure to check it out. Link will be in the description below. And well, guys, last but definitely not the least, we're checking out 5217, which is basically based on the article, which found out that the most productive cycle is comprised of a work amount of 52 two minutes followed by a 17 minute break. Now this is different from the Pomodoro technique that I'm sure you guys must have heard of before if you're looking at productivity applications. Now this app puts that into existence. You basically open the app, you have a 52 minute timer that you turn on. The app has a lot of really cool alarm music and a lot of motivational quotes that it keeps giving you on your notification throughout this 52 minutes. And once the 52 minute timer is complete, you get a 17 minute break period. And there's been a lot of research done in this. And I feel like this is something that will Will really help you increase your productivity and if you want a timer app to also track how much work you're doing this works really really well also has android wear support if you have an android smartwatch so i think this just you know puts it all together in a very nice way and well guys that is pretty much it for today's video if you guys did like it be sure to drop a like subscribe to the channel let me know which was your productive application that you are going to use from now on i feel like you guys should give dash lane action dash as well as taskade a very very big try and also more videos on these topics coming soon be sure to subscribe and stay subscribed with that said this is Anwar signing out I'll catch you guys next time you guys have a great day stay safe and peace out